No hot water for more than a month. That's what people at an apartment complex in Lansing are claiming. Darlin Horn caught up with some of them and she's here for you now with their frustration and reaction from management. Yes, that's right, Sherry and Siobhan. This so-called water crisis is happening at Fountain Place Apartments on Washington Avenue. Some say it's been going on since Thanksgiving. So it's at this point, it's been 70, 70 six days. Stacy Pizzardi says that's how long she's had to take cold showers and it's making her bitter about living here at Fountain Place Apartments. So I'm washing dishes with cold water, taking baths with cold water, washing my hands with cold water. She says she's lived here for five years and while living with autism and post-traumatic stress disorder is hard enough, having no hot water is the icing on the cake she didn't ask for. And then I've been going through medical issues in this time frame and I kind of didn't notice. I mean, I noticed, but I got used to not having hot water as messed up as that seems. At least four other residents who did not want to go on camera confirmed with Six News that the cold water problems here started back in mid-November. So we reached out to the management company Princeton. A spokesperson said, quote, we are aware of the concerns raised about the temperature of the hot water and are working diligently with our contractor to address the issue. But the building has had and continues to have hot water, even though Pizzardi says she has hot water today Day for the first time in a while. She believes this is only temporary. And it's not even that I want to know why. I just want to have my water. Honestly, just give me one. Give me hot water. The other four residents tell me that the issue has been a boiler problem and they've been told by management that it will be getting fixed very soon. Sherry Siobhan.